This video guides you through how to create a slideshow, schedule the slideshow for playout, and then upload it to the BKMFW 50s in your screens. Begin by logging into the author account in Zyrus Create. In Add Content, go to File, New Slideshow. A dialog box that opens will allow you to select where you'd like to save the slideshow. Give the slideshow a name and a description. It's important that you select the BKMFW50 as your device type before you create your slideshow. On creation, you'll be navigated to the Edit Layout page. Here, select the newly created slideshow from your left-hand side and double-click it to open it for editing. Now you can add your content. Select your content folder and the type of content that you'd like to add. Your images will show up on the left hand side and you can drag and drop them into the toolbar below. Here, adding an unsupported type of content will result in the error message being shown on the bottom left hand side of the page. Notice the asterisk next to the name of your slideshow at the top right hand side of your page. This notes that you haven't saved your work yet and so clicking saved will remove the asterisk. Now that your slideshow is ready for playout, the schedule can be edited ready for upload. In Edit Schedule go to File, New Day Schedule. You can choose where to save it, and give it a name and a description. Again, it's very important to choose the BKMFW50 as your device type. Once created, you can locate the new schedule and select it to add your slideshows to. Choose your slideshow and drag it and drop it onto the day schedule. You can input the start time and the end time of each slideshow. Save this day, noting again the asterisk that tells you that you haven't saved your work. Create a week schedule by clicking the week schedule tab, file and new week schedule. You can choose where to save it and give it a name and a description. Once again, it's very important that you choose the correct device type. Select the new week schedule and drag and drop the day schedule onto the day that it must be played out. Note the chain icon under the name of each day. This allows you to set content to be duplicated across these days quickly and easily. Here, Monday to Friday are linked together, with Saturday and Sunday left unlinked. Changing content in one linked day We'll change it in all of the days that are linked to it. Save the week schedule. The asterisk on the right hand side will disappear once again. With schedules created, set the date of upload in the set playout section. This can be done by day, by week, or by month. Drag your week schedule onto the day that you'd like it to start. The blue on the left hand side indicates that your upload is pending. Right click and click Test Connection. If the connection is OK, we can upload our content onto the FW50s by clicking Upload. The yellow line now indicates 
that the content is uploading. Progress of content can be monitored by the percentage next to the FW50 channel. Once uploaded successfully, the yellow bar will turn green and your content has been uploaded to the FW50 ready for playout when the schedule begins.